Distinguished guests, members of the media, ladies and gentlemen, it is with great humility that I welcome you to the second Model ECOWAS Summit and also wish to thank you for your time. I believe this day is, is a unique day for the whole of West Africa. I am humbled by the tax before us, grateful for your trust, mindful of your sacrifices, the sacrifices that you have made, the generosity and the cooperation that you have shown. We are, we are most grateful to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and Regional Integration and to our sponsors and partners for making today's event a success. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of all, I'd like to welcome you to this event. And i also like to say that today's event is in two folds. We have what we call the plenary section and the breakout sections. At the plenary section, we will have the heads of state address the whole house. And after that, we we'll break into committee sections where we we'll have ministers of state and ambassadors address very technical issues. I believe in West African's destiny and potentials. I believe in West Africa's ability to continue moving forward to a brighter future than we have all shared. Today, I say that the challenges we face are real. They are serious and they are many. They will not be met easily or in a short period of time. But I know this for one thing. West Africa, they will be met. We remain a young sub-region, but in the words of scripture, the time has come to set aside childish things. The time has come to reaffirm our enduring spirit, to, to choose a better history, to carry forward that pre precious gift, that noble idea passed on from generation to generation, the God-given promise that we are all equal, all are free and all deserve a better chance to pursue their full measure of happiness. We must work, I say, for the progress of West Africa. Not just West Africa, but Africa as a whole. Ladies and gentlemen, let me once again say that we are grateful to the government and the people of Ghana for hosting us or for accepting to host us in Ghana for the second Model ECOWAS Summit. And let me thank my colleague, Head of State, Fusina Haziz, for hosting us here in Accra, Ghana for the summit. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, whether you are a first-timer or you are an experienced delegate. You are sure that you enjoy the great Ghanaian culture. Ghana is known for championing democracy. And let me say to my colleague head of state, Fusina Aziz, that as her country goes into an election, in, on December 7, 20, November 7, 2016, we will, we, will, we will support them. Thank you so much and God bless us all.